helix body here, I tried just a small shot of that uh, trim clack graffiti remover and see how that goes. I'm gonna let it sit there for a couple minutes. So I was thinking too. Remember that? Well, what about this stuff? The bonder. Sure enough, also removes paint and most adhesive residues. So if that stuff doesn't work, I'm gonna try some of that on there. See if that'll take the paint off. Uh, I don't have, I have a, what, half a bottle left, so not a lot, but it's something. Alrighty, so that was the graffiti remover. It, uh, as you can see here, a couple of marks, it started to eat the plastic. So that's no good. Uh, the brake fluid, I don't know, didn't really do much. Uh, I'm gonna try some of this uncure and see what that does. Oh, that uncure, the bonder worked awesome. That came off from uh, just a little tiny dab right there. Did all of that. So wow. Um, I don't know. Try it in the big container maybe. And that's some on the hood. And you see it's going right down to the white. And you see a little bit red, then blue, and then white, and then. Let's give her a wipe and see what happens with that. Oh, it's just muck. It is breaking the paint up, but just... Oh, of course, garbage is getting full. Stay there. sitting there just came right up you see this white spot there now wow maybe I just gotta let it sit on there a little bit longer but I'm just kind of weary about how long to leave it sit so I don't want it to run like it's trying to do now and at the same time I don't want it to eat it up or anything so Maybe that's what I gotta do is use a bit more or something. But I wonder if it would have been just worth it in the end to just uh, just paint right over it. Oh well. Now it's turning into a goofy mess. Check this out. Look at that. Bet you that'll wipe right clean now. Yeah. Guess this isn't getting used for the fish tank again. <laughs> uh, grab that towel. That's just the one with the muck on it. good. So it's been about a half hour and you know I think it might be working. Oh look at that. It's starting to come up and off. I can't believe that. Oh. Gotta keep her soaked apparently is the key. Gotta keep her soaked. So I'm just getting stuff out of here with the brush and putting it back on. Look, you see the paint running. <laughs> this is working awesome. You see it running down the pillar and everything. Let's uh, see what I can get uh, off of this body today. I'm gonna try the hood up here a little bit more too here. I was trying that uh, remover debonder stuff, but I think this is going to do a much better job. They say it could take up to a whole day to be able to get everything off of this, so, you know, a little bit at a time, but man, I love that blue paint. I tried looking for a metallic blue and everything last night, and I just couldn't find it. 
So let's uh, give us more elbow grease and uh, see what happens. Well, I'd say that's working. Look at this on this other side here, though. Paint's already. You can see it coming apart on on the camera. Right. I just got to keep getting it on here, making it, making sure it's coated. And it's coming off. I'm awesome. I was awesomely stoked about that. You can see down the tray here. You can see some blue paint and stuff like that. But this red is flaking off good. It's got to keep her basted. So I'm going to try to get this truck done, this half of it done today, if I can. You know, see it's peeling up here some more too. Hard to do one handed, but do what I can. In the next shot I'm going to try to show you a lot of it missing. Alright, so I moved to a bigger container because, well, I was making a mess. <laughs> Quite simple. But check out the top here. Look at that. That's incredible. So there was even actually a primer underneath the blue, underneath the red. So it's coming apart. Uh, might have to redo the filling again. I, I had a bad feeling about that, but might have to. Uh, the fender down here, blue showing up underneath. Still very tempted to do blue, but I can't. I just, I can't for this body. I got plans, and I've got stuff that I've already ordered, so no backing out now. But just scraping it, and gotta keep dousing it. Gotta keep putting the stuff up here. And I found if I flip it over and get it in the juice and let it sit that way, it works even better. That's how I got some of this up here getting going like this. So look at this, you can just, you can see it. See it come right off. You can see the block. Look at that. Holy crap. Fun times. Let's uh well, I'm gonna work on this a little bit more. I've used about uh, about the four there on the bottle, so I still got some left to go, but yummy.